In this short video, we'll be talking about barbiturates. Barbiturates are a class of drugs that acts on the central nervous system and acts like a depressant. So in the brain, it works and give a calming effect. It is used for sedative, hypnotic and anticonvulsant properties. So it basically acts on the GABAergic synapses and alters the modularity in that synapses. So if we zoom into a postsynapse of a GABAergic synapse, we can see the GABA A type receptors, which binds to the GABA and allow chloride ion to get in. So barbiturate enhance the inhibitory effect of GABAergic synapses. So this is a zoomed in view. You can see that there are two different sites other than the GABA binding sites in the, in the GABAergic receptor. So this site in orange, which is in the interface of alpha and gamma subunit is a ben benzodiazepine binding site and the interface between alpha and beta subunit is the barbiturate binding site. So barbiturate binds to this particular site and what it, what it does after binding? So barbiturate increase the chloride influx. Um, the way it increase is basically it allow the channel to be open for longer time. So the influx duration of the chloride is increased due to the channel opening time. This is very different from the benzodiazepine, which increase the frequency of opening, but does not change the duration. In this case, barbiturate change the duration of opening. So as a result of too much chloride ion getting in, the action potential firing probability is decreased at the postsynaptic level. So in the post synapse, if we look at the membrane, it becomes slowly more negative. That means hyperpolarized. So that leads to uh, reduced possibility of uh, <coughs> uh, uh, firing an action potential. Okay, so let's talk about the usage of barbiturates. So it could be used as sedatives. So barbiturates like phenobarbital were historically used to sedate people. Then it could be also used in terms of anesthesia. Thiopental is a short acting barbiturate used to rapid induction of anesthesia. There could be also usage of barbiturate as anticonvulsant or seizure medication. But there could be adverse effects of barbiturate as well. It works like a CNS depressant. It would lead to drowsiness, sedation, respiratory depression, etc. Overdose could be fatal. Then there are uh, dependence of a barbiturate that can grow that could lead to some sort of like addiction as well as uh, there are other problems such as drug interactions. Barbiturate can induce hepatic enzymes such as C uh, CYP450 leading to accelerated metabolism of many other drugs. So it changes the pharmacokinetics of the drugs in the body. So it has to be carefully taken with the advice of a, a clinician. So I hope this video was useful. If you like this video, give it a quick thumbs up. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. See you in the next video.